Torres. And I'm Liliana Rodriguez. And today we're at our school in San Lorenzo and we're going to show you what high schoolers are actually wearing. Come on, join us. Uh, I feel like a lot of people who thrift kind of have like very similar aesthetics. After I shaved my hair, I started dressing more like ambiguously. So some days I dress very feminine and then other days I'll dress very masculine. I'm different every day. I'm, I'm wild. I cannot be tamed. Oh, am I supposed to say what's my name? Uh, I'm Robert Ramirez. I go to SLZ. Um, basically anything because I would wear anything. Oh, I'm Bella and I learned how to do this the other day. <laughs> Okay, wait, a switch? Yep. Okay, I got it. Um, I'm like in between girly but athletic. I would describe my style as like a, a homeless person with style that tries but doesn't want to try. I would describe my style as 90s plus 70s mixed in a bowl and like had a bunch of kids. I would definitely say I dress for myself. Others, like like men. I dress for myself because who wants to come to school uncomfortable? Like seriously. I dress for myself. I dress for myself because I feel like if I tried dressing for others, I would never be happy with myself. I always dress for myself. I never dress for anyone else because that's too much work. Um, I guess I used to be more like, I wouldn't show more of myself. And now I'm like expressing myself with my clothing. Oh yeah, for sure, just uh, differently from freshman year. I feel like I wear a lot more colors because uh, freshman year I probably just wore like all black, all white, uh, things like that. I'm much more, I was much more simple back then. I definitely dressed hella different than I did freshman year. Freshman year, it was, I wore like really embarrassing clothes. I, that's when I think um, either like late middle school or early freshman year is when I first started thrift shopping and oh God, it was bad. Uh, I'm pretty more like talkative this year. I like your style. <laughs> <laughs> oh. Okay, go again. Oh yeah, uh, I used to wear more sweats this year. <laughs> uh, yeah, I dress more like according to school code this year because I used to get dress coded a lot last year. Um, sometimes it sucks and it's stupid. But then again, no, it sucks. Um, honestly, I'm not gonna lie, I do not follow dress code. I find most of the dress code to be ridiculous. If I'm not showing anything inappropriate, then I don't really see it as being a problem. Uh, I think the dress code is probably one of the worst things that the school could have. I feel like it uh, unfairly targets the women at this school. Uh, it promotes a culture that uh, isn't conducive towards women in society. And for me, it's just not fair. I think dress code is like crap because a girl should be able to express herself in whatever way without actually like bothering anybody. It's when like does how a girl dress like affect your education. Like it shouldn't affect your education. You should actually learn how to have respect for others. No one influences my style because, wait let me repeat that. None of my friends influence my style because I dress the best out of all of them. There, there's a, there are a few people that, that I see that definitely influence how I dress. Uh, there's a lot of rappers out there that I definitely like to copy my style from, like uh, Mick Jenkins, uh, maybe Isaiah Rashad. My friends would like to disagree, but I think I started some trends. So, for example, when I first wore, started wearing Crocs back last year, everyone clowned on me. Nobody liked them. And look, now all my friends want a pair. So, first of all, I think that's a trend. Second of all, I think that, I don't know, I think I start a lot of dresses. I think I wear really cool clothes and uh, my friends think that it's cool too and they start wearing it. Uh, I don't know if I have, but I think I started the jeans with sandals trends. Oh, last year I wore fishnets one day and everybody thought I looked like, everybody thought I looked weird, but now everybody wants to wear fishnets. Cut, cut. Don't get cut. This is cut. This is cut. That's tape. 